Welcome, friends. Uh, today we're trying oak gingerbread, their flavor for the festive season, and uh, I would just like to take a second to admire this lovely packaging. The little gingerbread men look so happy and excited that it's Christmas time. Well, it's November, but um, yeah, the uh, the the Christmas. Uh, sweater design in the gingerbread man is really delightful and cute and I'd just like to highlight that it's really fun uh, their their blurb on the on the side reads "Twas the night before Christmas and not a creature was stirring or was there under the tree oak is waiting with a merry blend of ginger and spice to wrap hungry thirsty up tighter than an ugly jumper Nan buys you every year, then smothers it with festive cheer until it can't breathe. Not even nice, bar humbug. Um, I, the best thing about that blurb is how it's not funny or clever. Um, they probably should have just described the drink uh, and just called it a day. Anyway, no one reads that part. No one cares. <laughs> Let's see what it tastes like and smells like. Very gingerbready. A little bit chemically, but we'll see what the um what the flavor actually tastes like. You know, for oak, it's not as it's not as thick and rich as I was expecting. Um I was really expecting them to go all in in terms of like the the texture and thickness and richness of this and it's um it's even not that gingerbready really like I'm not getting the like herbaceousness that I feel like I should be tasting from this um it kind of just tastes like sweet cookies like it um it tastes like if you were drinking McDonald's cookies, that's what it would taste like. But I I don't think it's thick and rich enough, and it kind of doesn't even taste like gingerbread. Um, just kind of tastes like, um, like, kind of buttermilk cookies or something. Um, like, still festive, I would drink it, but, like, I... Yeah, I expected a lot more than, uh, I expect, let's start again, I expected a lot more from Oak in this instance, because, like, they really went all in with the packaging and stuff, um, but, yeah, it's, it's a miss for me, like, I'd, I'd say it's two, like, it, it, um, it doesn't even reach what it's supposed to be, and that's a bit disappointing, um, if I was writing the packaging, it'd be five, but the drink that's inside of it, I'd say, is a two. So, um, yeah, uh, have a great Christmas later on, down the track, uh, and, uh, stay safe, take it easy.